I totally agree, Ghost of the North. This is quite an impressive game for the Game Boy Color. Partial, so, I mean, it's like the the AI is bad. <laughs> but, uh, uh, so here's the thing. I hate the Game Boy Color. I despise it as a system. But that doesn't mean that, like, I despise Game Boy Color games. The thing is, the Game Boy Color was a horrendously terrible system. It was, like, barely more powerful than an original Game Boy. But years later, it, like, inexcusable laziness. Uh, let me get Queen Azarel. She'll help me the most. Uh, uh... But, like, that that does not change the fact that what some developers managed to do on the Game Boy was downright Herculean. <laughs> okay, let's, uh, build some Brax. Pours one out for Bomb Whiz. <laughs> Look, he probably deserved to die. Uh, let me actually put it just right next to this one. And then this looks like an area I'm gonna have to defend. How are we doing on freeing that jerk? <laughs> Not enough gold. Fine. Can do that. You just go be somewhere safe. Go go all the way back there. Oh yeah! I don't have Ice Whiz. How did I lose Ice Whiz? Odd. Uh hmm. Yeah, go north. That's the way. North will get you south. Great AI! Really good. Uh, I'm actually gonna build a rare guard tower. Oh my god. Guard tower. Uh... How about right in front of this enemy unit right there? How about right in front of the enemy guard tower? It's the guard tower v guard tower action you've been after! What did you get confused? Okay, <laughs> great, great. I've made good decisions here. Don't forget to let Brickwiz reinforce your towers, says Becklad. I mean, I'm gonna have to, like, survive long enough first. Boy, they just have free reign over my land now, huh? Real-time strategy. In real time. Could you, like, actually do something, idiots? <laughs> oh my god. Where are they coming from? Is there- there must be a monster spawner. There are a, uh, barracks, that is. Because they just keep on coming for me. No, don't go over there. Go over here. I assume that bell is warning me about something. He's not even attacking. He's just standing there and getting killed. Good job, AI. You did it. That bell means your food is ready, says Kyle. <laughs> ah. The delivery should start any moment now. Attack! Could you, like, do something? What are you doing? Go destroy the barracks. They have many barracks, I! That's the plural of barracks. Okay, we destroyed a barracks. That's probably a good thing. No, 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 no. Okay, they destroyed my main all that easily, huh? Okay. Noted. Okay, we're just gonna have a detachment on guarding the main hall at all times. <laughs> Turns out, that's what that bell is. That bell is your main hall being attacked. This cave is now tower defense, says Kyle, making me angry. Okay, so we've still got food problems. I guess I knew that. Okay, that's a problem. I don't have enough something to build a building. Uh, more like it! Build towers instead of units. Towers don't eat food, says Becklad. Fair point. I should build, now that we know what's going on, I should build some guard towers to guard the actual, like, main fort here. I feel like in the original Warcraft, or maybe only in Warcraft 2, you could see, uh, who was, uh, defending, uh, or how many, how many, like, gold people you had, how many, uh, uh, <laughs> people you had. Do you just have to exist? Are you, are you one of those? You just have to exist to do your job? Oh my god. Uh... 
I want you to do uh, another one of these. Go somewhere safe. Okay, now it is time for barracks. Should probably exist far away from the action or he's going to super die. Yeah, that's why I put him up there. It's fine. Oh my god. Queen Azarel, you're in the way. <sighs> Let me just like wall him off. That seems like an idea. Stick a barracks here. I'm gonna get you over here. Still guarding this, but like guard from that side so you're doing less blocking workers. <laughs> So you know what? No, don't guard him. You start getting fuel, probably. Could you, like, do some guarding or... <laughs> More archers. So as usual, security start stops workers from doing their actual jobs. That's right, Kyle. Nope, nope. Okay. I've got what I believe to be a pretty reasonable detachment standing guard. Now I just need an equally reasonable detachment, like, ready to go. I think I need more workers on gold. Not enough food? Oh dear. Not enough something to build food, not enough gold, I think. Okay. Oy vey! Part of the problem is that the gold workers are using just brilliant pathfinding. And nope, can't go that way, so let's go all the way up and around. <laughs> okay. One, two, three, four, five archers. Four archers. <laughs> I feel like I'm fighting a losing battle and I haven't even started fighting the battle yet. Okay, let me... Let me send an actual detachment here. Not much of a detachment, but a detachment. Be sure to throw your soldiers at the enemies as blindly as possible, says Kyle. You're damn right. What are... Oh my god, the multi-select! This is, so I, I'm gonna say I despise tower defense, but this isn't quite tower defense. This is still an RTS. Destroy as many of their barracks as we can manage. Ooh, a dragon egg. Don't mind if I do. See if Brickwiz can repair the guard towers. The guard towers don't seem to be particularly damaged. You already own an adult dragon. A baby will stay inside the main hall until you need a replacement. Yeah, I got some other stuff to deal with before the dragon, thank you. I keep on hearing a death sound that's actually our own death sound and assuming it's not that. Can't workers repair towers or can they only repair bridges? They can repair towers, Becklad. I think they can also repair the main hall, but I just didn't do that fast enough last time. What are my objectives again, other than like, live? Uh, Defend the main hall, destroy the, okay. So just destroy their stuff, fine. Let's recruit some more of our own here. Your baby dragon grew up. <laughs> Obanek Zimniakovsky says, hello there. Do you want to try again to say my name? <laughs> Apparently I do. I'm gonna sacrifice my last two, uh, last few soldiers here. Oh yeah, they're dead. Get another detachment going! As many as can, like, find their way into position, anyway. Idiots. <laughs> I hate the AI! <laughs> Look at this, this worker is walk- this worker is just, like, on a death march because he doesn't know where to go. Okay, worker, I don't know who you're supposed to be or what you're supposed to be doing. Great, I'm sending the worker. The worker's coming with us. The multi-select is so bad that the worker's coming with us to die. <laughs> Another, uh, that thing. It seems like they maybe don't have a main hall or, or any workers, so if we just destroy all of their barracks and such, and particularly their, uh, farms, then they are L-screwed. I wanna know what this is. 
Brr, so cold, the icicles are as hard as a rock. Does anyone have a pickaxe? Well, workers do. I accidentally brought a worker here. Oh, look at that. I assumed the worker would already be dead, but nope. How are they getting money without workers, says Becklad? They don't pay their, uh, their, their warriors. Dragon is guarding her nest. Beware, she will attack invade intruders and may even kill her hatchling if disturbed. Okay. So don't. Just don't go that way. Just don't go that way. Are you a wizard too? Are you like a homeless wizard? Toxic Wiz? This is a weird game. <laughs> Anyone spell gas? This maker of noxious fumes will bring tears to the eyes of your enemies. His toxic gas cloud kills any nearby units while it lingers in the air. Tap the A button to cast his spell on an enemy unit. Tap the B button to attack an area of ground. I think this should be fairly safe right now. Let's go north. Yo, this game is pretty cool though, says Mask Dragon. I agree. I think this game is actually excellent. <laughs> it's, uh, it feels very much like they were right up against the limit of what the Game Boy Color could do, and sometimes that is very troublesome, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. Turns out they had a base of operations right there. <laughs> that close to me. <laughs> The wizards are like knights in Shovel Knight, says Kyle Johnson. Yeah, actually. So you recruited a mad nuclear science into your medieval fantasy army. Yup, seems legit, says Godvin. Yeah, exactly. Hold down the B button to move the cursor at double speed. Oh, well that's really good knowledge. I would have liked to know that like half the game ago, game. I have located another two-player map. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to kill that dragon. Uh, I don't know how to do that though. It's pretty much invulnerable as I recall. Oh well, here goes, what could possibly go wrong? Probably my dragon will be dead. Oh, we win. Yes. <laughs> Why, it's a spare baby dragon. Send toxic whiz to kill the dragon, suggests spec lad. No, no, I just collect wizards, I don't use them. It's probably a pretty safe path for you to get home right now. Just use archers, says Kyle. So the problem is that while dragons are only vulnerable to sharpened sticks, uh, archers are also very vulnerable to them, so I was assuming sending the dragon in as well would be a good idea. Uh, okay, there's the vast northwest, I guess. Apparently they're also quite vulnerable to fireballs, says Becklad. Uh, yeah, it did say that other dragons could harm them. I don't remember exactly what it says because I was so busy just being amused by the idea that nothing can harm them except for arrows! It's just like a lone farm out here. <laughs> uh, should I be worried about the farm exploding over there? No, it's probably fine. Wow, a lot of baby dragons, huh? Just like a collection of uh, dragonlets. Oh, that was it! Mission completed! You are victorious! Spider's Lair. Let me get a sense for the music so I can choose my voice. Our outpost near the Gondor Desert is being raided by beast soldiers. The beasts are using human prisoners to feed a giant spider in return for resources. Queen Azarel orders you to defend the outpost and mobilize an attack force to destroy the giant spider. Objectives! Destroy giant spider! Defend main hall! Okay, we got a new tile set! Oh wait, there's there's workers over there to do that. Well, whatever. Only have knichts, huh? This trail of footprints was made by the enemy! Following them could be dangerous! Not enough cash to build more, uh, workers. There we go. This is some dramatic music. So since you spawned over there, let me grab this real quick. Workers can repair damage building. Yeah, I know. I already found that. That's an enemy. Get out of the way. Get out of the way better. More guard towers. Guard towers were almost useless before and are basically mandatory now. 
That's probably the most useful direction for them, although as I dig through this forest, that's gonna get more useful too. Uh, let me go ahead and build nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. Is this really the pattern you use to, uh, to do this? <laughs> I heard arrow shafts, but whatever, we're probably fine. Wonder if there's a restriction on the number of buildings, says Specklad. I mean, I imagine there's some restriction, but probably just programmatically. Oh, food. Yeah, food is an issue. Okay, it's time for barracks. It's time for barracks. Uh... This is some very dramatic music. We do have a temple, right? Yes. You! Build nothing, because we don't have enough, uh, fuel. Okay, this is ludicrous. This is ridiculous. Why are you taking this route? <laughs> Archers. Wonder if the game is over if the queen dies, says Specklad. What an excellent point, because the, the death does seem to be permadeath. Draw. Okay. Ma. Tick. Mu. Zick. Draw. Matic music. <laughs> Not enough anything. Resources, though. Uh, let me actually snag you, and redirect you and get you also on gold. Not that, you know, anything. <laughs> okay, you're an idiot. <laughs> I would like one more guard tower here. I wonder, is your amount of golden fuel always divisible by ten, asks Specklad. It does seem like, since everything consumes it in tens and increments it in tens, the zero at the end is utterly without purpose. Not enough money... What are you doing? Idiot. <laughs> Got three workers on gold, I think three workers on wood. That seems pretty reasonable. I think I'm just being impatient, basically. <laughs> Dramatic. Music. Dramatic. Music. Dramatic. Music. Let's get ourselves a nice detachment going. In, like, exactly the worst possible configuration. Uh, I should probably recruit BrickWiz. I don't remember how he works, <laughs> but I should probably recruit him anyway. I think he's one of the, like, you just need to have him. He just needs to be around. Food. Wow, great. Hokey dokey. I think I'm pretty decent for protection, I just need to, like... Yeah, get... Great. Good, good job. That's the path you should be walking. Make sure to alert that enemy. <laughs> Curious. You can check wizard descriptions in the menu. Good point, good point. <laughs> but I'm not going to. Okay, that'll be my de detachment. Go for it! Kill them all. Grab that scroll! Return a wizard to the temple to restore its health level. Oh, that's interesting. So, we could have saved the bomb wizard, but instead we let him die. Well, we seem to be on our way to something important here. That is clearly a barracks. Seems like a pretty decent detachment here. It seems to be absolutely mutilating them, though obviously once a few of them die, then things are gonna be, uh, you know, going badly for us. Hello. Ah, so that is battlements up there. Good to know. Let me deal with these because they're just gonna cause me trouble. We're looking pretty good at home. Uh, okay, tree situation looking slightly dire. Hopefully he's gonna be intercepted by stuff. Yeah, it'll be fine. <laughs> well, he'll be intercepted by something, I hope. Okay. Great, you're just gonna stand around like an idiot. Perfect, perfect. What could possibly go wrong? You'll be fine. Where's my main detachment? Just spread all over the place. Great. Gotta watch the watch for their pathfinding to do something stupid all the time. Just constantly, 
constantly be vigilant about their terrible pathfinding. Okay, I think I actually have all of my detachment finally selected again. <laughs> oh, there's the giant spider. It's, uh, starting to chug. Get a lot of stuff on screen, and it is a little bit slow. Well, looks like you're just gonna be on the wall, because you're an idiot. <laughs> Is the giant spider a building, asks Specklad. I would bet that it is. I think that Warcraft 2 had an enemy like that. Fantastic AI on the enemy's part here. Destroy all these guards. Boy, I hope we uh, end up with enough uh, of a detachment here to actually destroy the uh, the giant spider. Shoot from the battlement, points out Specklad. I mean, yeah, I should, but that would involve so much more pathfinding. Yeah, we're all gonna be dead. Particularly these ones who have decided to just wander in the most stupid way possible. Oh god, we're under attack, we're under attack. Are Queen and Brickwiz okay? Of course they are. The enemy AI is terrible. It doesn't know that there's any point in attacking anyone in particular. Okay, okay, okay. Things are getting hectic. I accidentally grabbed a worker. That's how hectic things are getting. Oh, things are very hectic. Things are quite hectic. I think I just need to send out this detachment. Strength and defense on the left, says Kyle. Yeah, definitely. Mm, apparently not. Uh, yeah, wood. Wood is a real problem. Multi-select is also a real problem. I love how the skeleton also goes, Ugh! Oh yeah, my fuel isn't divisible by ten. Good point, Specklad. Something takes five. Take a worker with the detachment to find a new forest. I, I feel like this is not a game where, like, there's too much is happening too urgently. You can't sort of go, okay, I need to just take some time to find another forest. I mean, I know that I should be putting them on the battlements to attack, but that's not what I did, is it? Oh, we did it! <laughs> Didn't even see the spider explode! Specklad says a tool assisted speedrun of this would probably have epic micromanagement. Yay! I assume this is the kind of game where a tool assisted speedrun just basically breaks the game. Like it's just glitch after glitch after glitch. And essentially you just have like one worker kill everything. Dust storms have ruined the crops and our soldiers face starvation in the arid southern lands. Scouts have located a beast plantation. Queen Azarel orders you to sh steal fuel from this guarded enclosure and build ten farms to avert the fa famine. Legends of this region tell of a wizard with the power of stealth. If found, he would be a great ally. Defend the main hall. Build ten farms. There are no forests. There, there's nothing. <laughs> are these enemies? Are these friends? These tracks were made by our scouts. They should be safe to follow. Okay. I thought Sleep Wiz was the one with the power of stealth, says Mechlad. Hmm. They should be safe to follow! They should be safe to follow! Are there no resources at all on this map? Boy, when they called the Southern Lands arid, they weren't kidding, eh? I see. <laughs> These tracks should be safe to follow. We're the regiment of funny soldiers. <laughs> exactly, Specklad. 
This trail of footprints was made by the enemy. Following it can be dangerous. Wow. They sure put us in a difficult spot here. It's nothing for the workers to do because I have literally nothing. I think my best bet is to come all the way up here and kill these jerks one at a time. And then that at least gives me some kind of resources I can deal with. Or not. Or not. This seems too dangerous.